Stacy Mitchell. This is Kevin Davis. I sent you a sincere message last year, and I'm sending you another one. Now, from that last message I sent last year to now, how much better has your life gotten? Not good, Stacy. In fact, it's gotten five times worse. All right. I know everything that's going on, Stacy. And like I tried to tell you then, and I'm trying to tell you now, guys like Christopher Mitchell are pieces of shit. They're used you. He's abusing you, and he's locked you in with the kid. He's locked you in with the fucking your dad co-signing uh, on that car. He's taking you down. All right. There's people back home in Cleveland that continue to email me begging, begging me to try to get through to you and help you out. All right. And I'm doing it now. I got people out in Vegas that will help you if you just reach out all right i know about you balling balling your eyes out this week with outside your home walking the kid all right i know when and when all the time when you guys are arguing and it's been quite a lot stacy quite a lot all right think about the vacation last week how you guys had to do, do it all secretly okay stacy I'm not your father. I don't even know who the fuck you are. I've never met you. But I know this, Stacy. There's people that will help you. Okay? If you leave Christopher now, all right, your life will shoot skyrocket. Okay? Skyrocket back. Because right now, you guys are going down. Down. He's locked you in. He's trapped you. I know all about the casinos. You guys are 86 from, okay? I know why Christopher continues to go to Red Rocks right now, all right? I know a lot of shit, Stacy. A lot of shit. I know all about Christopher Mitchell's sports betting uh, scam. So, scam, let's just say that, Stacy. Think about what I'm saying. I know a lot, okay? And Christopher is going down. And he's taking you with you, okay? I'm not going to stop, Stacy. all right? I'm not going to stop. But I'm telling you right now, uh, taking to expose, not only expose Christopher, but see him behind bars, all right? I am not going to stop, Stacy. And again, I told you in the beginning of this message, think long and hard what I'm saying, okay? I don't get my information right away. All right, it takes a little bit, but when I get my information, I get a lot, okay? Stacy, I'm telling you right now, think about your daughter. Your daughter, think about your son, okay? Think about if you leave now, all right, how much, and I know it's going to pay, pay for you to think about, all right? Pay for you to think about, but think about it. You were at your lowest when the scumbag like Christopher came around and thought he scooped you up, okay? When you leave now, you're going to be at your lowest again. And guess what? Another guy might come around, all right? But this time, this time, Stacy, you can actually think about, think about, all right, what you went through and what you put, can put your guard up, all right? You got kids, Stacy kids all right think about what i know i know christopher is dying dying to find out who's watching his house all right how did i know three days after you guys got in vegas where you guys live all right think about it stacy you'll never find out how i get my information ever and again i don't get it right away it takes a little bit but I get my information, okay? Now, please, Stacy. as again, you got people in Cleveland that'll help you out, okay? I don't know how. I don't know why you allowed your dad to co-sign on that car, okay? I don't know why, but, but he did, all right? He did. That does it because Christopher locked you in. He knew you guys were arguing. He knew you guys were going in. And he 
smooths shit over, smooths shit over like he always does, and he fucking got you to uh, your dad to co-sign on that car. All right, it does it, Stacy. All I can say is this: you want help? I'm easy to find. I got people out in Vegas. They're not gonna baby you, but I'm telling you right now. If you want to leave Christopher and he tries anything, anything, I got people out in Vegas. And I swear on my life, uh, Stacy. I swear on my life, I am not kidding. I have people out in Vegas that will help you, that will keep you away from Christopher, and keep Christopher away from you, I mean. That's all I can say, Stacy. That's it. All right. You, I don't know you. I, yeah, and for me to even put myself out there like that, but again, Stacey, I know all the shit. Think about the tax evasion. Think about the IRS, okay? I know that. Think about, think about what's going on with what I know about the sports thing, all right? I know everything about the sports. That's all I'm going to say, Stacy. You got tax evasion. You got fucking uh, wire fraud. Now you got some shit, other shit. Think about it. You went to Vegas, and how much life, how far has your life gone down? You guys are not welcome there in Vegas, uh, Vegas anymore, Stacy. But don't worry about that because what? Christopher's got some online sports spending thing going on now. No, Stacy. All right. And again, I have no clue who the fuck you are. But look at my last video, Stacy, about this, how about what I think about women that are fucking uh, getting beat up and all this other shit, Stacy. Again, if you need our help, I'm easy to find, easy, easy to get a hold of. RLDrooster70 at gmail.com, Stacy. Okay? We'll come in, we'll help you, we'll keep Christopher away from you, and we'll take send him back home. And Stacy, you will have our help away getting keep Christopher away from you, okay? He'll never bother you again. And this is coming from somebody that doesn't even fucking know you, Stacy. But I can swear on my life, swear to God on my life, Stacy. What I'm saying is God honestly true. Okay, that's all I can say. I'm going to leave this message up. And again, rldrooster70 at gmail.com and he'll never bother you again. It's going to take a while for you to get your life back together. You can go back to nursing. And guess what, Stacy? There will be somebody at that hospital that will fuck take, take you and Champers and get you and your daughter back together back in Cleveland. So I can say, Stacy, ball's back in your court. Take care. And I hope you reach out.